floods in China caused deaths. Flash floods in southwest and northwest China have left at least a dozen dead and put thousands of others in harm's way. In the southwestern province of Sichuan, at least six people have died and another twelve are missing after torrential rain, triggered flash floods, and about 1,300 people had been evacuated. Meanwhile, in Longnan City, in the northwestern province of Gansu, another six deaths were reported, and 3,000 people had been evacuated. State broadcaster CCTV said, "Rainfall over one and a half days was as much as 98.9 millimeters in the worst affected areas, almost double the July average, with rainstorms continuing to large southern and eastern regions, including Guangdong, Guangxi, and Jiangxi." State media said some 85 rivers nationwide have experienced floods above the warning level. In the low-lying Pearl River basin, which encompasses Guangdong and Guangxi, the downpours have dangerously swamped some 54 waterways, threatening manufacturing, shipping, and logistics operation at a time when supply chains are already stressed because of China's strict COVID-19 controls. Authorities in Guangdong said that. More than 200,000 people have been evacuated over the course of the disaster, and that damage so far is estimated at 1.7 billion yuan. Shangguan also issued a red flood alert, the most serious, after multiple rural counties and the major city of Faoshan upgraded their flood warnings in recent days. In neighboring Guangxi region, muddy water was seen flooding urban areas, and emergency rescuers were seen evacuating villagers on rubber dinghies. The rains come amid a heat wave in parts of the country, including eastern Jiayang Province and the city of Shanghai, with temperatures soaring as high as 42 degrees Celsius. This is BBS News. Thank you for listening.